Hi, I'm Adriana Wright here with Desiree Smith, and today we're going to talk about her new yoga studio. Hi, how are you today? I'm good, how are you? I'm good. So, can you tell me a little bit about your studio? Yes, yeah, so um, I have a yoga studio. Uh, it just opened up in Norristown, right on the um, historic Black Main Street. Uh, the date of the opening was February the 16th, so it's been open for um, almost about a month or so. And um, yeah, all level uh, vinyasa yoga is what I teach. We have weekly classes there. Um, beginners classes just started this Sunday. Uh, yeah, so it's a studio for everyone, um, everyone to come enjoy and to get whatever they're looking for out of yoga out of it. Okay, and what made you start to get into yoga? Like what made you want to open a studio? Mm. Um, so what has gotten me into yoga is one day, uh, this was about I would say seven years ago or so, um, I used to play flag football. Uh, and I was actually looking for something to keep my body uh, mobile, keep my body a little bit more flexible. Um, and also I was looking at that time for some sort of peace outlet. So um, when you look at yoga, it looks peaceful, you know what I mean? That's kind of the concept that it gives off if you don't really know much about it. So at the time I was also looking for that as well as um, working on my sports performance. I uh, looked up a hot yoga studio in King of Prussia. That was my very first yoga experience, and I fell in love with it. Um, so the benefits that it had to offer, um, reducing stress, anxiety, um, as well as getting me a little bit more mobile and flexible with my body as well. Um, so I started to practice it consistently. Um, saw even more benefits from doing that, and uh, essentially I knew, like I would say, probably a year or so after that that I wanted to start to do more with it. Um, so I applied to yoga teacher training last year. I was become a yoga instructor. I totally changed my life um, in so many ways. <laughs> and um, I knew like that I wanted to offer my benefits, what I was receiving out of yoga to everyone else um, in the world, even if I can help them like in one way or another, um, letting them know that change is possible. Uh, and yeah, you can get so many benefits and more more than you think you can out of yoga. So um, I decided to open up a studio for everyone to come receive. Okay, and how would you describe your classes like at your studio? Well, since I'm from uh, a hot yoga background, um, if you don't know what hot yoga is, it is doing yoga almost like in a sauna. So it's like 90 degrees, um, between 80 and 90, I would say. They have warm yoga and hot yoga, but um, I do the hot stuff. So the room is about um, 90 degrees and you're doing yoga, so it's super intense, but it's also super calming at the same time. So um, with my background being from that type of um, yoga, it's called vinyasa yoga, vinyasa hot yoga rather, um, my classes that I offer are, um, I would say a little bit more, a little bit of everything, but a little bit more intense than anything. Okay. And how much does one class cost or how can someone sign up? Sure. Um, so one class is $15. Um, however, I do offer a um, unlimited two weeks of yoga for new students that um, have never been to the studio before. Um, so you pay $25. You can come to as many classes as you would like um, in those two weeks. Um, and there's also monthly packages, yearly packages, annual packages, 10-day passes, 20-day passes. So um, lots of options. Um, but uh, those prices vary, but just one class is 15. Okay, and how does someone sign up to get into one of your classes? Sure, so um, they can actually sign up on the class at my website at www.dchanelyoga.com. -E okay, and how did you come up with the name of your studio and like what, what, what inspired you to name it? Sure, so the studio um, that I hold the classes at is actually um, called Studio 7 Complex. Um, so I am a co-owner of the studio. There is also going to be lots of other things um, coming up at that location. But I, the yoga aspect just kind of opened up the doors for um, the studio. But the two other co-owners came out with a beautiful name. And um, how it's written is really nice. But my brand um, with the studio, D Chanel Yoga, is actually, D stands for my first name, Desiree. And Chanel is my middle name. So something simple and basic but um, yeah it gets the point across. And you kind of mentioned how yoga benefited you but what can someone else take from your classes and stuff like that? Sure. 
Um, so if they don't take anything else, um, they'll definitely take the concept of the breath with them. So by that, I mean um, in yoga, if you can't do anything else, if you don't want to do the poses, if you're just tired or if you just need to take a break, um, the only requirement in my classes is for you to just breathe. Um, the breath I would say or I would explain in yoga is um, the start of everything. So, you know, your breath gets you through everything. Like if you get mad, if you get sad, if you get angry, any emotions that you kind of go through, the first thing that someone tells you is to take a deep breath. And that's because it works. So if you get distracted by any thoughts in my class, um, you'll learn how to keep a calm breath, um, keep your body calm, keep your mind calm, and uh, yeah. Okay, is there anything else you would like to add? Hmm. I would say that never be afraid to try yoga. Um, like I said in the beginning, like um, most people just see yoga as something uh, you know, peaceful, but they don't really know what, um, I guess, other benefits that it has for you. So try, I've worked with um, and currently work with so many people, so from children, um, it benefits them in so many ways, um, to adults, older people, elders, um, uh, athletes, you know what I mean, to keep them going, um, you know, all, it's all kinds of yoga too, so uh, try it, you know what I mean, don't be afraid to try it. Okay, thank you. I'm Adriana Ray, and I'm here with Desiree Smith, and we talked about her yoga studio. Back to our host.